Hello, this is Brian Houle. I'm a solutions consultant with Beyond 20, and today I'm looking at the tab group widget for dashboards in Sharewell version 10. Uh, and this is a very cool control that allows you to display tabs of either plain text or rich text content on a dashboard. And I was thinking to myself, how would I use this? And documentation immediately came to mind, like system documentation. You can create dashboards uh, specifically for roles or teams and display them with uh, role or team uh, appropriate documentation. So let's take a look at how this is built. So I'll go ahead and uh, edit the tab. Uh, I'm sorry, edit the dashboard and look at the tab widget. Um, so this lives in the widget manager uh, under the Shapes Etc. node. So you can just click and drag that over. I've already done that here. But let's edit this and see what it looks like. So I'll right click on the widget and choose Widget Properties. And here I can name my widget. It's very familiar to those of you used to working with dashboards and widgets. Tab group is the type. I can have a default title. And I can position my tabs top, bottom, left, or right. And I did it on the left. I kind of like that horizontal look there. Um, but you can also uh, do it to the top. Let's do it on the bottom and see what that looks like. Right, so now it moves down to the bottom, so you've got kind of that thing going. That's pretty cool. Let's edit it back. And of course, you can also uh, add it to the top or the right. I'm going to leave it at left-hand side. I kind of like that uh, sort of dictionary-style indexing there. Um, so to, to add a tab, you're just going to click New Tab. Uh, you can also delete your tabs or reorder them with these buttons here. So if I wanted to move that up, I can just do it like that. Now, each tab will have a tab name and a content type. There are two choices, either plain text or rich text. I'm doing rich text, which allows me to click the Zoom Out button, and I'll get my rich text editor, and I can put in here anything, you know, any rich text content that I want. Um, here I've just got a simple bullet list and, a, and an image. Um, however, here I've done sort of a two-column situation using a, a table. So I can have text on the left and image on the right. And uh, it, it's pretty, pretty simple, pretty cool, but I think it's pretty powerful. So I'll go ahead and click Save, click OK, and you notice my tabs move back. So when I run this, now I can kind of flip through various aspects and kind of get this like flashcard thing going here. I think this is a very cool uh, addition to the, the, the system. Um, it's the first time I've been looking at it, um, but uh, again, I am looking at this in version 10, and uh, I think you might find it useful too. So uh, thanks for watching, and uh, please subscribe to our YouTube channel for more shareable videos. Thanks.